Hello and welcome everybody. Akamon DL here and you did read that title correctly. We are going to be backing up our Dragalia Lost save file as well as downloading assets for said save file. All right, now the, these are both going to be very important and these are both going to be pretty, pretty constrenuous to do. So this should hopefully help you guys have everything you need in order to download these files and also be ready. So before we start downloading stuff, we're going to go over some pre prerequisites to keep in mind. All right. So first of all, uh, I was I uh, this is my second take. Uh, by the way, your Dragalia Lost account must be linked to your Nintendo account. Make sure you do that right now. Uh, then then you'll need a 64-bit or a 32-bit of of net. Whichever one your computer skips. I did both personally because I didn't know it, it, it worked just fine. And you also need WebView 2 installed as well. Uh, mine was already installed because of something Microsoft Edge or related. Um, you will need to, uh, you will need this script available. And also you will need Python downloaded on your computer and your Android or your Apple device. Every single one of these will be linked in the description down below. You are welcome. So, when it comes to download Python for, for the computer, there are a couple things you must keep in mind. Alright? So, so when, downloading, so, when downloading Python for the computer, you must make sure it is, it is enabled to be added to Path. That is a must-do. This will not work otherwise. You will then work on installing it accordingly. Hello, there we go. But then, but then, uh, uh, but then on your search bar down here, look up app app execution analysis and turn off Python. What the computer will try to do is that it will try to lead you to a Windows version of Python, and and, and this applies for Windows 10 and above. If you are not on Windows 10 or above, you can ignore this step. This, by turning both these off, you will be ignoring that entirely, and you will be using this version of Python we just downloaded. So, with all that out of the way, you should be ready to start to acquire your files. And once again, make sure Python is down for, for Android and Apple, depending on your device. So, we're going to start with your save file here. So we're going to go to the releases tab over here. We're going to download Dragalia Save Downloader dot zip. Pretty self-explanatory. You see the three because I've done this multiple times to make sure I understood this method. You're going to extract these files as well. Uh, we're going to close out of the original folder here and we're going to run the Dragalia client over here. Make sure to run it anyway. It is fine. So right here. We now have your Nintendo account. You will log into your Nintendo account, make sure you select the correct one, and you will have three text prompts I will go over at the at the end of all this. Do not worry about it, all right? But that is it for your save file. The save file is literally that easy. So, so now moving on from from the save file, we're going to move into the assets themselves. All right, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to download this zip file. You're going to open it. You're also going to ex you're also going to go to extraction. I'm used to Warframe terms. I apologize. We do not need that original file anymore. And we're going to go into Dragalia Essential Assets, and I'm just going to move this to to a easier folder. Uh, you you are able to move this directly into downloads. I do already, so therefore I do not have to worry about replacing uh, the file. So over here in downloads, you are you you will be seeing Dragalia Essential Assets. We're going to open. We're going to edit this in idle, and, and there's going to be a very a very specific reason why. All right, you're you're going to see all this right here. You're only going to worry about these variables here. Okay. These will be set to zero when you first open up this file. These are going to be your files related to the language. So, 
So English, Chinese, and Taiwan. All right. So obviously, well, I say obvious. I'm assuming just if you speak English, you're going to want the English files. So therefore, you're going to want to set it to one. These will be the files you are going to download. And let's say you also want Chinese. You also set that to one. And, and well, oh, oh, hey, wait, I also want Taiwan. You also set that to one. You can, you can leave some stuff at zero. Those will not be downloaded. So, so just if you want a smaller file size, just simply set it at zero. Me personally, I'm going to want everything. So I'm going to set that to one. Make sure you save it. And that is ready. So now what we're going to do is is we're just going to click on, on this bar right here, caps lock CMD, and this will pull up a command prompt. Now we're going to input two prompts here, okay? So, so pay attention now. We're going to input this prompt here. All right. Uh, I'm going to, uh, can I actually? No, no, I cannot. So, so, so just make sure you have this prompt right here. Selected. We're going to enter. You will be getting some installs here. Uh, enter. There we go. So there we go. I don't know why that was like that. So, so for me, I already have them installed. You will be getting something different. It should be a little bit more on the colorful side. Do not worry about that. So once when you have those install requests installed, you will now be entering the second prompt. So it will be. Python, Dragalia, Essential, Assets.py. So click on enter. And, and it will say you will be downloading several things. Me personally, I already have those files because it says, because it's, because because it says here, cannot create a file when that file already exists. So, so that, so that will be pretty much it. Uh, you will have master assets, you will have EN assets, but then whatever else you get, uh, CN assets and Taiwan assets, you will have those. So then, at the end of the day, you should have, at the minimum, these files en assets master assets your endeavor text document your mission list text document and your save data document all right all of these you are able to move into its own separate folder and there you go it is surprisingly easy it's a it was a lot of prerequisite stuff it took me three hours to get this because i did not understand a lick of python so I so I really hope this does help out everybody in order to uh, in order to really get that ball rolling. And that's just, and that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully you all did enjoy. Um, I'm not a Python expert, so I cannot help you guys. I'm just saying that right now. And this really is going to be a step in the right direction for 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 something big in the future. As for what. I don't know. I just know this is available and I would much rather have my save data on backlog rather than not at all. So that's it. And I'll see you all in the next video, whenever that may be. Goodbye.